Hello. Um, with the influx of um, young people and just migrants in general to the southern border, is there any sense, and I ask this question with the person, obviously you're only two months into the administration, but early on you and uh, uh, Secretary Mayorkas very much stressed humanity uh, and trying to move away from the, the last administration. Do you, does, does the message need to be tweaked at all? Do you need to say that it's not just about humanity, that also you might not get in, or you probably aren't going to be able to stay. Well, humanity will always be a value uh, from the president on down. Uh, but you are right that we are continuing to work to convey to people in the region that this is not the time to come, that the majority of people who come to the border will be turned away, which is factually accurate. And what we're really talking about in terms of uh, the people who are being let in are unaccompanied children. That is a policy decision which we made because we felt it was the most humane approach to uh, addressing what are very difficult circumstances in the region. And that means there are more children, kids under the age of 18, of course, coming across the border. At this point, is this a crisis at the border? Look, I don't think we need to sit here and put new labels on what we have already conveyed is challenging. What we have conveyed is a top priority for the president. What our policy teams are working on every single day. They obviously, there was a trip to the border uh, this weekend. They are working uh, over the course of every day uh, since then on putting in place policies that can help address what we're seeing and, and help ensure that we are uh, keeping these kids safe and moving them as quickly as possible from uh, border patrol facilities to uh, to shelters where they can have access to educational resources, health resources, mental health resources, legal aid, etc. Go ahead. Uh, on follow up on that, Jen, thanks. Um, 